Shalom Israel. I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Raka, Quedash. Double honors to the apostles and elders who teach and rule well at Great Millstone. And peace and salutations and peace and mercy to the prophets, the whole four elect, the 144,000, and to the men and women of the 12 lost tribes of Israel, you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. Shalom. Uh, back with another lesson. Um, I'll title this one uh, Your guns, your weapons, they're not going to save you. Your, your, your guns and your, your, your weapons are not going to save you. Call Halal Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai. Call Halal Yimla, Abanawa Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai. And uh, uh, this lesson is, uh, you know, it sparked. I was reading this article uh, just a few ago, uh, and, it, and it was basically uh, going into. Uh, the, the the as far as guns, you know, weapons right now because of all, you know, uh, you know the the, the you know the, 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 the crime, um, you know, uh, you, you 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 know, with all this military talk and, um, you know, it, it, it it's the it's the kind of. Uh, uh, it's you know it's been stir it's been stirred up these you know these Americans man because it 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 was saying that um, last year in 2020, 2022, over sixteen million guns were sold last year here in America. You see that in two thousand and twenty two over. Over 16 million guns were sold here in America, and what, what, what I think it was saying, uh, the the uh, gun, the, the fight, mm -hmm. the firearm business is what is it? It's like what was it? Um, 60 billion? I think it's worth like 60 billion. I think it was something like that. It's something billion, like like 50 or 60 billion. I think that the gun. Uh, you know the gun business here in America, and and it said uh, for forty five percent of Americans have at least one firearm in their home. Cause this this place is the valley of the shadow of death, man. But uh, you know, uh, cause chaos is coming. Chaos is coming, man. You know, there's civil war, world war, world war, world war three. Um, total anarchy coming, man. Lawlessness and people, you know, uh, they, you know, buying all this ammunition and uh, buying buying these weapons, and then you have Israel. These, you know, you have Israel. You know, Jake, man. Uh, you know, two thirds, good majority of Jake, they put their trust in in their gun and in, in, in that gun, man, and their weapons. And this and in, in this time coming. Of, of Jacob's trouble, your weapons and your guns are not going to deliver you. They're not going to save you out of this time. They're not going to protect you. You see, it's not even going to pr protect Esau. And Esau, is he was blessed with the sword. You see? And, and Esau has, uh, 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 you know, those slaughter bots. He, uh, 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 with those drones. Um, uh, uh, those uh, what are those hydrogen and oxygen bombs? Uh, those lasers and uh, he has that artificial intelligence. And and Esau is bringing this out in the end time. And he going matter of fact, let me let me get the uh, Esau gonna bring this out in the end time. Matter of fact, let me get, let me go straight to it. Let me go. Um, let me go here. That goes right into it. I don't want to make this too long, but just a quick hit through the power and the spirit of Yahweh, Baha Shem Yahweh Shai. It, you know, you know the, the 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 heat is being turned up, man. The collapse is on. You know, because Esau about to, uh, uh, you know, 
the 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 your American dollar bill, you know, the days of having bands on top of bands is coming to an end. You see, and we, we we're coming into that mark that 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 digital money, that RFID, the hour of temptation, man, and. Uh, Esau, Esau needs uh, chaos And this thing is about to spiral Way out of control Way out of control We're coming into, we're coming into a, a period of time of, of sedition amongst men Where, where you know uh, People are going to run up in your household They're going to run up in your household And take what they want These gangs These street gangs And thugs And militia groups And hate groups and stuff we're coming into that time. You know, grocery stores burned down, malls burned down, uh, schools broken into, taken over. And, and, and people want protection. But to Israel, to you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians, you, the, your weapons are not going to save you, man. They're not even going to, like I said, it's not going to save Esau. But let me, uh, uh, and Esau is bringing in, um, you know, uh, Esau is bringing in, in his military. And he finna cash the trench uh, around, man, and, and, and corner you in. Ultimately, you Israel, you, you Israelites, man. But it says, uh, but all these preppers and, uh, you know, so-called uh, little even little, uh, you know, militia groups and stuff like that. You're not gonna be able to take on this beast, man. Let me let me go here. Let me go here. Um, Revelation 13. Revelation 13 and one. I'll start at Reve Revelation 13 and one, and it reads. It says, it says, and I stood upon the sand of the sea. And saw a beast rise out. And saw a beast rise up out of the sea, having seven heads and ten horns. And we know uh, those seven heads. Uh, well, you know, Daniel. He's seen it. You know, he's seen it. You know, he's seen it first. Um, but the, those, those seven heads represent the, the, those power structures, man. And what is it? Uh, 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 what is it? Uh, the uh, Greeks, the Greeks, the um, the Romans, the French, uh, the the Brits. Um, the, I think this what the Spanish, the Spaniards, and then uh, German uh, major, Ger Germania um, uh, minor. Those th those are the seven the, the seven heads, man. And then it says in ten horns. And those are the, the the ten horns are those ten common markets that uh, you know that basically uh, you know set up NATO, man. It says, um, and upon his horns, ten crowns, and these are these are the uh, governments, the ten crowns. It says, and upon his heads, and a, and a, and upon his head, Salakia, and upon. And upon his heads, the name of blasphemy. Two, it says, and the beast which I saw was like unto unto a leopard, and that and that uh, leopard is, is started with that Alexander the Greek. It says, and his feet were as the feet of of a bear, and it started with Alexander the Greek, and is going in with Russia, the bear. It says, and his mouth. As the mouth of a lion, and that's that, and that's that Britain, that Great Britain. It says, and the dragon, the dragon is the is the Roman Empire. See, it says, um, the dragon gave him his power, and his seat, and great authority, and, and we all know it's Satan, man. Um, they're ruling under their their. their uh, <coughs> Their, their daddy, the the Satan man. It says um, three, and I saw one of his heads as it were wounded to death, and his deadly wound was healed. 
and all the world wondered after the beast and we all know that's in that renaissance time man you know and it is it is uh 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 it's uh this is where we're in the time of the revival of the roman empire <laughs> Salakia, Salakia. It says, um, but this is the point right here. This is the point. It says, four. It says, and they worshipped the dragon which gave which gave power unto the beast. And we all, and we all know. Um, uh, the beast is um, NATO, and the whore is um, uh, America, man. The whore that sits on top of the beast, and the dragon is the Roman Empire. It says, and they worshipped the dragon, which had which gave power unto the beast, and they worshipped the beast, saying. Who is like the who is like unto the beast? This is the point. This is the point right here. Who is able to make war with him? You see? Who is able to make war with him? And, and we all know, you know, in this time of uh, you know, Jacob's trouble and this tribute great tribulation that's coming, man. You know, Esau's trouble. Um, you know, uh, who is gonna be a who, you know. Who's gonna be able to make war with with uh, with the beast, man? Because Esau is bringing out uh, that his military, like I said, them them drones, them slaughter bots. He's bringing out his artificial intelligence, his robots, his uh, mechanical canine uh, uh, robotic dogs. You know uh, uh, these different laser beams and uh, you know different technology and stuff to where they they can see. Uh, different X X ray visions and you know uh, all type of stuff, man. There's a lot of stuff that we don't even the public ain't even we don't we've never even heard of because this is this is the this is the left hand of the Lord that he saw. He you know he's he's blessed with the sword, man. But you know your guns and your weapons are not going to save you in this time. This is the whole point, man. You think that you're going to be able to withstand on basically what the Lord is sending out judgment in this time. You are going to have to have him, Israel. You're going to have to have the Lord. But like the Lord say, he that killeth with the sword must be killed with the sword. So if you think that gun is going to save you, that's how you're going to go out. You're not going to make it, man. We, 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 you know, uh, the real servants of the Lord, man, the hope for elect, they you know, Lord willing, I'm part of the hope for elect. We're not, we're not using guns. I know for myself, I'm not, I don't, I don't, it ain't no gun for me, man. It's your how by she or shy or nothing. Ain't no guns, ain't no weapons, ain't no knives. I'm, this is, this is, I'm putting all my chips I'm, all my bet, all I'm betting all my chips on Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shah. I'm putting all my faith in him that he's going to guide me and protect me and my family in this time of danger and terror and chaos. I'm putting all my faith in the Lord, man. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't want no gun. I don't want no knives. I don't want no explosives. None. I'm putting all my faith in the Lord in this time, in this end time, that He He gonna guide me and protect me all the way through. And if I if I gotta get laid down, then I gotta get laid down. Thus saith the Lord, because like Job said, man, though He slay me, I still put my trust in Him. Though He slay me, see. And this is this is what it's going to have to take, man. Because uh, 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 you, you, you putting your your trust in these weapons and guns and stuff, it, it's not going to save you, man. As a matter of fact, let me close out with this. I just got a couple. Let me close out. Let me close out with this. Um, let me go to uh, uh, Romans Romans uh, eight Romans eight and 
5, Romans 8 and 5, and it reads, it says, For they that are after the flesh do mind the things of the flesh. See? But they that are after the spirit, the things of the spirit. Right. See? And, 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 and that flesh, you know, is about pleasure and, um, you know, uh, being carnal, man. It says, six, for to be carnally minded, this is the point, this is the point right here, for, for to be carnally minded is death, but to be spiritually minded is life and peace, man, see, the Lord said, uh, 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 for to be carnally minded is death, and, and you, you know, putting that, your trust and thinking that you're going to use these guns and weapons, you're being carnal minded. So you're going to be put to death. Those that are trusting in your guns and in your knives and your explosion, the explosives and whatever else weapons that you think that you're going to use in this time against this beast. See, it's going to take a, a, a higher... It's going to take the Lord, man. It's going to take a higher beam. It's going to take the Lord, uh, uh, um, you know, to take Esau out of here, man, to remove him from his seat. Because what Esau got is God-like uh, technology. And then, you know, uh, and then also across, then uh, you know, Babylon, you know, you know, the, the citizens, they, they're, they, they're armed. I just I just told you read you the the uh, statistic uh, over four uh, what over forty five percent of Americans have at least one firearm in their in their household. That's almost half the country, and we all know in this in, you know when the chaos started, and, uh, you know uh, in, the, in the in the tribulation and uh, uh, the civil war and all that. It's going to be heavy artillery on the streets. A lot of people going to be put to death with gun or without a gun. But they they didn't they didn't put their trust in the Lord, man. But the Lord said, "For to be carnally minded is death, but to be spiritually spiritually minded is life and peace." And I'll leave it there, man. I'll leave it there. But, uh, you know, this, you know, you're you going to have to have the Lord in this end, end time. The Lord said, without me, there's no savior. You want to be delivered. You want to be saved out of this time of tribulation, uh, Israel, to you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. Because ultimately, this is who salvation is for, is for Israel, ultimately, the elect. The elect is going to be saved out of this time of tribulation. They're going to be delivered. There's going to be so much terror and chaos going on. People are going to be terrified, man. They're going to want to get out of this. But the only way out of this is through Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai, the Savior. Shalom.